environment. Okay. So let's start. What is a Prometheus? So Prometheus is an open source system monitoring and alerting toolkit originally built at SoundCloud. It records real-time metrics in a time series database built using the HTTP pool model with flexible queries and real-time alerting. It can absorb huge amount of data every second. Okay. Or we can say that Prometheus is a automated monitoring and alerting tools. Okay. So by default, it's it has a service discovery. Okay. So there are some components of Prometheus like node exporter, alert manager, service discovery. Okay. So this component automated discover the services inside the Kubernetes cluster and generates the real-time metrics. Okay. So next, uh, we configure whenever there is a, something is a lot, goes around in a Kubernetes cluster. So we have we should get alerts via using the email or in a team, Slack or anything. So then alert, we need an alert manager. The alert manager handles alert sent by a client application, such as the Prometheus server. It takes care of duplicating, grouping, and routing them to the correct receiver integration, such as email, page duty, MS team, Slack. It also takes care of silencing and inhibition of alerts. Okay. Then it is generally Prometheus alert manager are used to generate the metrics, okay? Whatever our Kubernetes cluster metrics, okay, all the components, they generate the metrics, okay? Then we need a graph now. If you want to show in a graphical manner, then there is a one more component is a graph now, okay? Graph now is open source visualization and analyzer analytics software. It allows you to query visualize alert or explore your metrics, no matter where they are stored. It provides charts, graph, and alerts for the web when connected to supported data sources such as Prometheus Graphite ETC. Okay. Prometheus has its inbuilt database, that is PromQL. Okay. So it stores the alerts in the PromQL database. So let's see the sample diagram. So here we have the Prometheus and we can add the Kubernetes clusters. Then to, not, to get a notification, we have to configure the alert manager. Then using that alert manager, you'll get the email or other notification channels will get alerts. Then we have the to visualize data, we need a graph. So this is simple diagram of to monitor the Kubernetes cluster using the Prometheus and Graph. So today we are going to cover only Prometheus, how to set up the Prometheus and Grafana using the helm on Kubernetes cluster. Okay. So that is the widely used method to set up the Prometheus Grafana on Kubernetes cluster. Okay. This is very simple. Okay. Let's go. So I have the Kubernetes cluster using the COX method. Let's check node. We have the one master and one worker node. Let's go to the step. Let's install Helm3 on Kubernetes cluster. Let's change the permission of the Helm's script. Install the Helm3 script. Okay, Helm is installed. 
let's check helm version okay now we can see the helm version 3.5 let's clear the screen let's add the prometheus and grafana helm helm chart in kubernetes so this is officially helm chart for prometheus and grafana let's add the this updated helm repo in the kubernetes cluster command is helm repo add stable helm chat okay helm is added in kubernetes repository then let's add the prometheus community helm chat in a Kubernetes cluster using the Helm repo add. So now let us is that they have moved to the Prometheus community. Okay. And this is a URL Prometheus community Helm chat. Okay. Prometheus community Helm chat is added. Let's search the what are the available available Prometheus community Helm chats. Here you can see the out the version. Here you can see Prometheus Home Channel Manager, Group Prometheus Tag. So these are the some components. Okay. So here we are going to use now the Prometheus community Helm chat is moved to the Group Prometheus tab for the Kubernetes cluster. Okay. Let's add this and chat. So help install stable Prometheus community and cook Prometheus tag. But this command yes. will help us to install Prometheus or? Yes. Oh. Yes, help me install stable Prometheus command. So help chat for Prometheus community is installed. Name is stable. State is default. Status is deployed, namespace is default. Okay. To check the Prometheus, Group Prometheus stack has been installed. So let's to check the whether it's created, installed or not. Command is kubectl namespace is default, get ports hyphen L it is stable. Okay. The Prometheus ports are running. So let's check port. So when we install Prometheus, so by default it contains the Prometheus alert manager and Grafana, okay, and Prometheus operator and metrics. These are some it created some ports. So still some ports are creating. Okay. Let's check the service. These are the services, alert manager, Kubernetes, Prometheus, Stable Grafana, then Cube State Metrics, all these things. Okay. To access, so we have installed the Prometheus and Grafana using the Helm chart, okay, which is a common tradition. So let's check the pod is running. So pod is running. So now we have to access Prometheus and Grafana outside. Okay. For that, screen. 
So we have to edit the service. Okay. So we have to find this Prometheus, this cube Prometheus state Prometheus. Okay. And by default, Prometheus port number is 9090. Okay. And Grafana port is 80. Okay. Let's edit the Prometheus service. So by default, it exposed to the cluster IP. So using the cluster IP, we can't access to the outside. Okay. We have to forward. So let's change to the load balancer. LMI is compulsory for the Prometheus. Yes. Is it dependent or what? LMI is dependent for the Prometheus. L is for whatever we have to install package. So L is a package manager. Okay, we can install any package out of the cluster using the L. Helm is officially package manager for the Kubernetes. Okay. Uh, same like uh, uh, in Ubuntu, you are looking for the Ubuntu or uh, uh, for, for Ubuntu, they are using the opt, right? Applicate, right? Same like right. that. Yes, yes, like this. So, Helm is developed by Cloud Native. Kubernetes is also managed by Cloud Native. They have developed their own package manager. Name is Helm. Okay. Like Ubuntu Apt or CentOS Yom. Yeah, I got it. Yes. So let's change into load balancer. Let's help. Let's take service. So now Prometheus is export to the load balancer. Let's expose Grafana also. And others, please go on mute. Let's read the Grafana service. Same thing to the load balancer. service. So Prometheus and Grafana is exposed to load balancer to access the outside. Okay. So let's access the Prometheus using the load balancer. Copy this load balancer URL port 9090. So there is some time difference between the so is is not able to be time managed between this local system of Kubernetes. That's why it is giving the warning. So here, as I said, that it contains the inbuilt alert also. Okay, you can go to the alerts. Here we have a different generator. It discovers the alerts for our Kubernetes cluster, like pod pod alerts, API alerts, all these things. Also, see, also you can get the graph. Just you have to check the search the type like the CPU. Just there are different types of parts available in the Prometheus. Okay, so let's check this code TLS. Click on the graph and then execute. It shows the graph also. 
Okay. Here you can monitor the networking nodes. Means how many incoming and outgoing 